on this bumpy 50 point inspection from Drecker Brewing Company out of Fargo, North Dakota. I have their brains, which is a strawberry, pineapple, raspberry, double fruited smoothie sour. Uh, this was gifted to me from Beer Man, so I appreciate him. Uh, it's the first time having brains. Now, this is, uh, they have different variants. I have an, another one from, uh, that was sent from Beer Man as well, which I'll also do a 50 point inspection on. Um, looking for the ABV on this right now. It does have a cool can art. Um,. Ale brewed with strawberry, pineapple, raspberry, salt, lactose, and vanilla. I seven percent on the bottom. Seven percent ABV, um, and it is uh, a little under two months old at the time of this inspection. Does uh, give you the malts and everything, which is pretty cool. It says uh, Pale Two Row, Wheat, Carafoam, Hops or Magnum, Palatal, Blanc, and the uh, yeast or the floor that's used is Lactobacillus Culture and House Ale Yeast. The gimmicks, which would be the fruit purees and stuff. Uh, strawberry, more strawberry, pineapple, more pineapple, raspberry, more raspberry, sea salt, lactose, and vanilla beans. Uh, it does give you a warning that um, to keep this cold because it it is an active, uh, an active uh, brew with all the uh, added fruits and stuff to it, um, and it also tells you to, to roll the can and everything, which I had already done previously, uh, to just keep it from uh, separating. So let's go ahead and crack into the brains, the strawberry, pineapple, raspberry ones. Really excited and. A bit nervous too because I've heard such great things about the Drecker. I can only hope it's true. Well, it definitely pours out like some brains. <laughs> All right, just a little bit left in the can. Got most of it in there, but the uh, bubble, the bubbly head is rocky. <laughs> it's got a kind of pinkish, cola brown coloration. Uh, very very rocky head yeah I didn't pour much of a head anyways uh, the beer itself is this pinkish purple magenta thing uh, very very um, opaque you cannot see through it murky whatever you want to call it all right let's get some aromas I pick up a little bit of the uh, vanilla bean from from afar some fruit notes in there too but yeah vanilla struck me first Ooh, wow. Um, yeah. Strawberry. Raspberry. Oh, this thing, it smells like a, I don't know, like a cake or something. Strawberry shortcake and nice raspberry. It smells velvety. It, it's like it's it's sweet. Uh, pineapple's kind of hard to pick up, uh, I think, from the other, the other notes that are coming through. But, you know. There's, there's this like bready cake, sweet cake type smell as well. Not able to pick up on the, uh, on any salt in it, but wow. I was really not expecting the aromas to come through that, that well. Um, especially when I smelled it from afar, like I said, I pick up the vanilla bean and then I wasn't getting too, too much fruit. And then you get your nose down in that. Wow. Great aromatics on this. All right. Really cannot wait to get into the, uh. The beer now, so cheers. It's got a uh, fairly full, full on medium, anyways, a medium to full mouthfeel. Kind of smooth, silky, nice carbonation on it. It's got a little bit of spritz, um, small carbonation bubbles, it seems like. Maybe in the medium realm, not, not overly carbonated. Great flavors coming through on this, too. Tons of strawberry notes. It really does have that sweet, like cake, malt backbone to this. It re it reminds me of those cakes that are, 
I'm not sure if they're artificially colored or not, but you get like the little pink cakes and they're like strawberry flavored. It's like it's like that. So lots of strawberry. There is some of that raspberry coming through as well. Getting some uh, chewy parts in there. The raspberry kind of, so with the strawberry and everything, it starts off with it, that sweet cake. Like I said, strawberry shortcake, sweet cake. Um, and then the raspberry kind of starts to kick in a bit. That's where it kind of gets that tart, a little, little bit sour. It's not overly, overly sour, but it definitely goes sweet into that, that sourness. I'm having a real hard time pinpointing uh, pineapple. Which, pineapple, I think, is a, is a pretty dominant type of flavor. So it's, uh, it's well hidden, <laughs> the pineapple. Uh, ABV at 7%. Yeah, uh, not noticeable in the flavor at all. I am getting a little bit of a warming sensation in the chest, but I have been <laughs> dealing with some acid reflux issues the past couple days. I, I'm hoping that I'm getting that under wraps here, but I am noticing a little bit of a burn in the chest. I'm not sure if it's from the alcohol or if it's from everything else. Just reacting with acid reflux but not bad anyways uh man all right it's time to uh put a score to this see where it stands So, for the appearance, I mean, it's not super pretty, really, but it kind of looks like brains a little bit. It's cool. It's nice. It's a pureed smoothie sour, so I'm going to expect the uh, that kind of gloopy look. Uh, six out of six for the appearance. On the aromatics, fantastic. Great. Awesome aromas coming out of this. I did have to ding it, though, because there is some others in there, and... The pineapple it's it's really missing that pineapple note for me so I'm gonna give it a 9 out of 10 for the aromas same goes for the flavor it's fantastic all the way through uh, I think the, the hops work well in this there is that you know balancing bouncing bitter uh, finish to it uh, it's not it's not like bitter bitter or anything like that but it's well balanced out the hops hops work well uh, the malts are nice in here. It's, it's good balanced beer. It's got good carbonation to it. Uh, flavors are fantastic overall. It uh, starts off with that sweet, goes to that kind of sour note. But I'm still not able to, to, uh, to pick up any of the, the uh, pineapple on my palate. So just missing out on that pineapple I'm gonna give it an 18 out of 19 for the flavors body a 5 out of 5 and my overall on this one I enjoy it these uh, type these are the type of sours that you know I, I enjoy drinking I do I do like these they're fantastic fantastic sours uh, a 10 out of 10 for my overall on this uh, and that's gonna give Drecker Brewing Company Brains, the strawberry, pineapple, raspberry, double fruit smoothie sour, bumpy 48 out of 50. So this is an excellent beer, and I want to appreciate and thank Beer Man for letting me try some Drecker. Appreciate it very much. Can't wait to uh, get into the other ones. Cheers.